No, not that part. Not that part again. Okay, well, this second to last video takes me from Princeton where I had to gas up again. And it takes me my closest point to Chicago. I'm just, you know, a few miles from Joliet. And I went ahead and started down towards well, towards Springfield. And um, in the video, I don't actually get here, but uh, I'm very close. I had to stop in Pontiac to gas up again. And this is the last time I saw my tail back. <laughs> but that's in the next video. Okay, well, here I am in Princeton, Illinois. I had to stop here because uh, the little Hooterville place that I stopped in, uh, I can't even think of the name of right now, uh, I was not able to get a receipt. So I uh, went down the road about an hour and found a better place and filled up again. So I doubt they'll have a problem with that. Oh, my shoulder's killing me! Oh, okay. Well, I'm not too far from my uh, turnaround in Chicago now, so... Once I hit that, it's up by Joliet. Joliet's 82 miles. It's like, I don't know, 5 or 10 miles before that head down to Springfield. I'll, I'll be feeling a lot better once I, I turn around and he start heading back towards St. Louis. Because, uh, buddy, I'm ready for this ride to be over. Oh, what was I thinking? My shoulder just, man, just like throbbing. My ass don't feel too bad, though. I have to put the music to this thing or something because uh, I've just been so preoccupied with the ride that, and other things. <laughs> so I haven't had a whole lot to say. I will say this, uh, man, there are a million and one motorcycles out today. I man, they're everywhere. And I've passed every one of them, damn it. That's a lot of them. I don't know what to think about my uh, speedometer. See, I'm running my uh, I'm running my Garmin GPS, and uh, then I've got my speedometer. Now, according to my, my speedometer, right now I'm doing 85, 86 miles an hour. Oh, fuck. I've got a destination in there, so it's not giving me my speed. It's off quite a bit. Uh, probably six or seven miles an hour off. So, uh, do I go by my garden? Or do I uh, go 85, 86, 87 miles an hour and go by my speedometer? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure how accurate uh, a GPS is going to be as far as calculating speed. I might be wrong there, but it seems like it, would, it wouldn't be able to, to do it like second by second and be accurate all the time. Like it would catch up every once in a while and give you an exact reading, you know, every few, I don't know. Seems like your speedometer would be more accurate, but... Oh. So I just passed the sign back there that said uh, the birthplace of uh, Ronald Reagan.
he uh, born around Princeton, Missouri? I have no idea. That was news to me. Okay, let's see what, where I'm at, and I'll shut it off. Chicago, 109. Joliet, 77. That means I got about, I don't know, 65, about 65 miles before I turn around and head towards Springfield. So I'm going to shut it off. I hope this is filming. I can barely tell. Okay, well, update, saddle sore. My ass hurt. I spent a lot of money on gas. I've seen some of the most boring uh, scenery. That there is. I've wiped enough bugs off my to choke a horse, and then I went roughly about three, uh, uh, roughly about 700 miles out of a thousand, and that took me about six more hours of riding. Six more hours. Oh, but my top that should be. So that puts me at about 9:30. So call it 10 o'clock to get home, so 4 o'clock in the morning, well, 4 or 4.30, to 10 o'clock at night, that's about, that's about as fast as you're going to do it, because, uh, I guess my better judgment, I didn't stop, I didn't stop for, uh, a meal, I ate at about 10 or 10.30, had a little sandwich, uh, but I'm just not really hungry, I could stand, uh, to guzzle a, a, a green tea, I think I'll do that at my next, uh, gas up. I don't know when that's going to be. Sometime in the next hour. Oh, 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 oh man. Well, um, at least I'm headed home now. 300 miles total. Uh, I'm looking at a little over four hours to get to St. Louis. And then uh, two hours to St. Louis to Mexico, so. With my fellow up, it'll be 10 o'clock for sure. That's not a bad time, really. But, uh, you know, I'm like sitting on this thing riding and thinking, oh my god, six more hours? And I'm almost done. I'm almost done! But yeah, I've got six more hours. Oh! Okay, well I'm just tired, so I ain't got anything to say.